I love this palette. <laughs> this is the Adeline X Tarte palette. Wait. <laughs> Hello, it is me, Alex, and I have not filmed here in a very long time, so here I am. I don't know if you can tell by the looks of this video, but one of my favorite human beings on the whole entire earth just released a palette and it makes me so happy and I thought I would just do a really cute, simple, fast makeup look to do with it. It's literally like three or four shades. <laughs> So anyone can achieve this look, it's really simple, just thought I'd throw it out there because I just really love this palette. I don't know if you guys know, but I am such an Adeline Moore stan. I am what they call an Adel Angel. Mm -hmm. I love spending my money on Adeline Moore and stuff. I actually have a pack of her scrunchies coming in the mail soon. Um, I love Adeline. Um, my obsession started when I actually met her. Okay, so she uploaded a new Harley Quinn video on her main channel, and um, that's a picture of me, her, and Mia, and uh, that's a picture of me and her hugging. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> it makes me so sad that I met Adeline, but I didn't know what I know now about Adeline. So I met her uh, when she went on tour with Mia at the Chicago show, which was like their first show. And it was like the tickets were so inexpensive and like everyone got a meet and greet and it was so amazing. I'm kind of rambling all over the place with this video. I'm kind of not sorry about it, but I just am. I don't even know what to say. <laughs> so I've just been a really diehard Adeline fan. I've been um, merch shout out of the week. Not the week. I have a merch shout of the day. And today's merch shout of the day goes to ad.on and Alex Bernardino on Instagram. You girls are slaying, looking good on Instagram. I gave it a double tap. I've been tip of the day. Every time I say tip of the day, I can kind of give a shout out to someone. Around like 12 hours ago, I I tweeted out, send me your favorite quotes for tips of the days. Here are mine. And so many of you guys responded. So I think it'd be cool to kind of have like tip of the days, but also shout out to this person for helping me find it. Because you guys know I always struggle to find a tip of the day. Oh, wait. This one's kind of funny. This one is from Alex. Shout out to Alex B. It says, yeah, blue. Why'd you slam the door? He asked what my favorite position was. I said CEO. Oh, <laughs> that one's so good. I just think Adeline and I are best friends. But she doesn't know that. But I know that because we still are that. <laughs> um, anyways, this is just a video of me playing with the palette for the first time. I just went for something simple. Anyways, this is my take on Adeline's new palette. Adeline, I'm so proud of you. I, you're pretty sure- <coughs> I'm pretty sure you're not watching this. <laughs> but, um, I'm proud of you, girly. Girls supporting girls. I bought- I was the first person to buy this palette from my Ulta that I went to. But yeah, anyways, um, I'm gonna go to this next part that's me doing the makeups. And I hope you guys enjoy it. So, thank you very much for watching. Good bye. Hello! Good bye! It's been a while. <laughs> so, this is Back to the Future Alex. This is Alex from the past. You were talking to Alex from the future. This is Alex from the past. So, I went to Ulta and I got the palette. <laughs> and she's so pretty. Okay. So, this is the Adeline X Tarte palette. It's pink and it's yellow and I expected nothing less from Adeline. <laughs> Let's open her up. She's so cute. My favorite part that I noticed about the palette is the little blue blue on the side. Oh, this is so cute. The mirror is so good. Don't want to show you guys my makeup vanity because it's a hot mess. And I just thought it was so cute to put the detailing of like little lemons and the hashtag Adeline X Tarte. Like it's just the little things that make everything put together that makes me really happy. So. As we can see, she is a pretty neutral palette. Also, I like the fact that that's just bent all the way. So that way, like, you know, the booty grooves, they go like this. 
but like I just gotta go like this and we have no mirror issues so I don't know if you've noticed but I've kind of done the rest of my makeup besides my eyes and part of my cheeks I just put a little bronzer in there I kind of figured she would have um Adel Angels, Beat Bop, Girls Supporting Girls and all the other ones were surprises. I was like, oh, they're so cute. <laughs> I love this palette. As Adeline was saying in her reveal video, it smells so good. It smells so good. I've had such good experience with Tarte shadows so far in my life. And I love them. I love their smell. I love their blendability. I love their formula. Tarte. I mean, if you need to make another YouTuber palette, don't hit me up. Because <laughs> I know. I'm not that great. Anyways, we're gonna get into the makeup portion of this video. Why did I just feel like Jeffree Star? I don't know. <laughs> but I think what we're gonna start with is Ada Angels, Adel Angels, Adel Angels, and we're just gonna dust this literally like all over my eye. I kind of just like to set my eyes in case of anything. So we're just gonna tip and tap. Yeah, I know. I need to clean my brushes. Okay. But is she gonna do that right now? No. <laughs> We're not cleaning the brushes. I'm gonna use the actual mirror because um, I don't know where mine <laughs> I don't know where mine went, okay? <laughs> so it literally is gonna look like nothing on my skin. It's literally gonna disappear. Because it's very close to my skin tone. And I'm kind of just dusting it around to set it. And ta-da! The first shade is already beautiful. Just kidding, you can't see it. But, <laughs> um, I honestly don't even know what I want to do. I think we're just gonna do like a warm toned crease with that pop of gold of Law of Attraction. Law of Attraction. Excuse me, rude. Also, I don't know if you've noticed, but the location of my videos have been rearranged. I moved in October. <laughs> and I just never talked about it. Never did anything about it. We're not even going to talk about it. <laughs> so next, I want to pick up the shade Mama Morin. I see her mom in her vlogs all of the time, and she's just like the cutest like mom ever. Like, she kind of reminds me of my mom because she wants nothing to do with the videos. <laughs> but like, we're still cheering you on in the background. That's my mom as well. So, she's blending very beautifully. Like, Tarte shadows are very beautiful. I love Tarte shadows. I have some of theirs, like when Graveyard Girl did a collab with Tarte, I was all over it. I was all over it. I loved that collab so much. And now that there's this one, we know. We know. We know. I love this palette. Hold on. I want more. More Mama Morn, please. <laughs> Alright. So, <laughs> we have Mama Morn. Placed her down. She laid. She slayed. Next, I'm going to grab just a little bit more of a precise blendy brush. But we're just going to go into the shade Contour. And my favorite. Ah! I watched her reveal video after I bought the palette but I didn't film it yet so like in between she said that she named this contour because of when she went on tour with her and Mia and because you can use this as a contour shade it looks like I could even use it as a contour shade um sorry I got distracted with the makeup <laughs> No, but I really, I like the shade. I like everything. Uh, she referenced the tour. That's what I meant to get at. Gosh. Um, and I was at that tour and I met Adeline and she told me that my makeup is really good. And she specifically was like, what are you using for your brows? And that day I had ran out of my usual brow stuff. So I ended up using some weird combination and like an Ulta Beauty brow mascara that was like two shades lighter than my actual brows and I thought they, they were not as snatched but Adeline thought they were so thank you Adeline for making me feel like my brows were good that day 
Now I'm going to grab a shader brush and I'm just going to pick up a uh, Law of Attraction. I'm trying to see if I'm getting it. <laughs> law of Attraction right there. Um, I just thought I would go for something super simple today for a makeup look only because I'm going to work today and I don't want to scare people <laughs> with um, <laughs> like a dramatic eye look. Okay, so already off the bat, um, I feel like the brush does not give it the full intensity that I believe Law of Attraction has, so I'm just going to pick some up on my finger. She's so beautiful, so shiny. And kind of pat her in. See how- well, do you already see, like, how much more brighter and intense that is? Like, can we just appreciate the difference of using a brush and using your fingers to apply shimmery shades? That's a difference, and I'm going to do the same for the other eye. Okay, so next what I usually do is I like to take one of the first like transition shades that I've used and blend it all together. So I'm just going to go back in with Mama Morn and I'm going to take an actual clean makeup brush for once. This is one of the new Jaclyn Hill brushes. This is JH33. I'm just going to take Mama Morn around, tap off excess, and kind of just make sure these shadows are blended the best of my ability so um while i'm also here i'm just going to take this same brush only because it's like tapered in a way i don't look like that <laughs> it's like tapered in a way to where i think i could get away with going on my lower lash line so i'm just going to take mama morn put her in her lash line and go from there i always feel like adding a little bit of color on your under eyes makes it just so much different like your eye look just like pulls all together once you put some shadow on your lower lash line okay so i'm pretty happy with how the eye makeup looks i am going to add a wing and some lashes i thought we would dip into mm, the little cheek shades we have going on here there's i feel beautiful and promise ring they're so pretty especially promise ring i just watched promise ring in store and girl promise ring is cute or whatever so I don't know why I just opened my makeup drawer, but I'm going to take a little brush, blush, brush, and dip into I Feel Beautiful. I can already tell it's packing on to the brush super good. So This is a super beautiful color. I think it is pretty versatile for different skin, different skin tones. Next, we're going to go in with Promise Ring. So we're just going to, I just feel like a little beauty guru. Okay, I don't really think I like using this brush. I'm kind of more used to this type of brush for highlighting. Ooh, there she goes. Promise ring is here, ladies and gentlemen. Next, I'm going to put promise ring on my nose. A little bit on the forehead, a little on the chin, a little on the cupid's bow. But I'm going to grab a smaller brush, like this one, like this one, and get my inner corners. Tadza! Just keeping up with the Tarte theme, I'm going to be using the Tarteist eyeliner. <laughs> so we're going to use the marker side for right now. I'm back. And I have lashes and liner now. Um, I thought the liner was going to be uh, cute and dainty and then I ended up with really dramatic wings. So here I am. So I need to add a lip color. Let's see what we got going on here. Mm, that's too dark. That's too light. That's too pink. That looks good. Okay. So for lipstick, I'm going to put on the Rimmel 60. I'm going to put on a Rimmel lipstick. This is in the shade 46. Um, I'm not sure if they still sell this or not. So here is the completed Evelyn X Tarte makeup look that I created. Um, I kind of wish I didn't go as dramatic with the lashes and the wings, but um, you know when you mess up your eyeliner and then you kind of just, oh let me just make this head a little bigger and then the other side is not as big and then you know you end up with like little panda eyes. That happened to me. So, <laughs> and my final thoughts, I just really love this palette. I love Adeline Morn. But yeah, um, if you want to, if you can, you can pick up this palette. I'm just going to be a huge Adeline plug for ever now. And Tarte is a really great brand because they're cruel, cruel, cruelty free? Cruelty free? Cruelty free. Cruelty free. They're very cruelty free and um, 
This palette is just so cute that you need it, so go and get it. I don't want to slam my palette on the <laughs> desk. Anyways, um, I think that's really all I have to say, but um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Adios, ladies.